Good morning, good afternoon, and good night to you wherever you are on the planet. That's right. Wait a minute. Can you see me? No, you can't see me. But this is miniature John Cena, the fake guy. And I just want you to know, wherever you are on the planet, this video is for you. If you like red dots, if you like inexpensive red dots, then check out my 1957 Chevy. No, 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 no. Check out these amazing optics by Sealy. So come with me as I give you the smackdown. Wait, that's that's not my line. You can take this out whatever you want. I'm such a classic country kid. I'm here born again. Amen. And before we get started, I'd love to shout out King Party of Six for sponsoring this week's video. Ladies and gentlemen, we've recently picked up our metal business cards from them. And oh my goodness, from a complete redesign of the previous cards that we had, they do everything there at King Party of Six. Oh my goodness. And guys, here's the beautiful thing about them. When you're talking about branding, they're not just branding on the business card side. Oh, no, 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 no. They got you covered with slaps in the event that you want any slaps. They got you covered in everything that you need in order to make your business and or your brand stand out. Even John Cena approves. <laughs> So guys, shop King's Party of Six and use the discount code GOTGAMAGE and save on your next purchase. Good morning, good afternoon, and good night to you wherever you are on the planet. You, listen, it is the real me this time. John Cena is over there with the 1954 Chevy but I still admire him nonetheless. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are bringing to you the entire Wolf lineup from Sealy Optics. This one was one that I was excited to do. I absolutely have fallen in love with Sealy Optics and it's not because I've been working with them and they've sponsored two optics for me. It has nothing to do with that. It has all to do with the quality and the affordability that I've been able to bring to other users of the product. Yeah, it's cool that Sealy and I work together that I get to get an optic out of the batch for reviewing it. But what the real win is, is when you guys get to get the optic at a discounted price that right there is what the win is for me. So I'm excited. I'm excited to run you through the Wolf Pack from Sealy. And just to make this as quick as possible, because that is my goal, to make it as thorough and as quick as possible for the user like you and I. Guys, there will be no table racking going on today. There will be no drop test going on today. Shouts out to my man, Jay Webb. If you would like to see the durability of the Sealy brand, head over to my brother. I shall link him here. Head over to my brother's page and watch his videos. He does an amazing thorough test of dropping and doing and janging and cack, cack, like the cack. The man is an animal, but here's what I'm saying to you today. We are going to give you the rundown on all four optics from Sealy within the Wolf Pack, starting with the Wolf Zero. Ladies and gentlemen, the Wolf Zero is a 3MOA reticle. It has the smallest dot, which, you know, for the people who are going for precision, that dot is for you. It also has the shake weight technology, which means for a lot of us, we understand if it's it's going to be in our holster that gun is, or that optic is going to be asleep matter of fact i take that back if it's in my holster i tend to shimmy when i'm moving around so i know mine stay on all the time but i don't know you may be a sitter and if you're a sitter then that thing is going to go to sleep guys in addition to the uh wolf zero being the having the shape weight it also has the top loading door for your battery now i like this because in some of the optics that we know and love um you have to remove them so that's a new that's a thing that most brands are going toward 
the top loading or the side loading. Either of those is dope to me because I don't like taking off my optic and then having to re-zero it, which I kind of find joy in that also, but I'm happy that this one doesn't allow for us to do that. Um, the Wolf Zero actually has 10 different brightness settings. Now, Sealy tells us that two of those brightness levels are for night vision. They say that it is actually invisible to the human eye when you're, when you're out doing this thing. And they say that for the first two, brightness levels on the wolf zero is actually meant for night vision so dope shout out to Sealy. if you want to purchase a wolf zero and off camp that thing then understand you do have the capability for night vision and uh that's something that we hope to get into in 2024. another thing the wolf zero is made for slides that have the top post you guys know some of your slides the aftermarket slides will have once they do the milling how you'll have those two rear posts in the back well there are optics that actually won't fit over those holes those posts and so the wolf zero is it actually has been made to be able to fit your slide that has the rear post so that's a dope thing the wolf zero comes in at a hundred and two dollars ladies and gentlemen a hundred and two dollars and you have a discount code $102 and you have a discount code, it's a no-brainer. It is a no-brainer. But moving on from the Wolf Zero over to the Wolf Two. Now, guys, if you recall, if you've been rocking with us for any length of time, we ran the Wolf Two on the Echelon because um, I remember the Wolf Two was the one, it is built strategically for the individual with a stigmatism. If you have a stigmatism, guys, the Wolf 2 is a phenomenal purchase. I'm going to skip all the way to the end because you've heard me say this before. At $123, guys, before the discount code for an RMR style footprint, a 3 MOA, and it already has that 64 freaking MOA circle around it, it is huge. That's the challenge that I had as great as an optic as it is it really does allow you to draw present that thing and then actually get a great sight picture out the gate because of that three moa and that 64 uh, moa ring that's around it everything is moving and tracking just like this it's just a lot of information as great as it is for crisp and not having like a bloom or flaring it still presents a lot of information in that window. Um, more information than I care for. One of the downsides that I had to the Sealy Wolf 2, matter of fact, I take that back. That's actually a downfall in all of the Sealy Wolf brands. Um, I think it's with the Bear 2, but I know for all of the Wolf Pack, it serves this. I'm not a huge fan. It ain't a big problem, but I'm not a huge fan of optics that take the uh, CR 1632 battery. It's that real small one. Um, personally, I'm not a fan of it because all of my other optics, either rifle optics or other um, optics, it takes the uh, 22 or the, what is it? The 2332, 2322, 22. It, they take the bigger size battery. These take the smaller size battery and that's just something you have to get used to. You got to know if you're going to jump into the Sealy market, jump into it with confidence on the price side, but then just stock up on CR1632 batteries so that way you have a batch of them. Since coming over to the Sealy side, I have actually bought um, two packs of them and I just keep one in my range bag and then one in my go bag um, so that in the event that any one of the batteries die, I have that available. Um, the Wolf 2 built with the stigmatism or built for the person, the shooter with the stigmatism. It also goes perfect. Uh, Sealy gives you the advice of saying you can mount this on any of your aftermarket slides that have the post in the rear. Beautiful job by Sealy for creating that. Um, I will tell you ahead of time, if you get the bear, the bear requires a plate to be mounted. The plate that comes with the bear, it does right here. The plate that comes with the bear, it does not mount on the post well. 
it does not. So the bear is one that actually, as great as that optic is, the, the plate that comes with it actually doesn't allow to be mated with slides with rear post on them. So that's a little challenging. However, back to the Wolfpack, these two will mill or will, will mount flush on any one of your or any one of your slides that have rear posts. So shot with confidence. That is a great layout. We move on to the Wolf Pro. Now, guys, the Wolf Pro is one of my favorite optics from Sealy. It's not the favorite, but it's definitely one of my favorites. The Wolf Pro, I absolutely love the body change that they went with from the two. Now, each each time Sealy has moved up and released a different one, they've changed that body ever so slightly. The Wolf Zero, it gave us that round front. But then as soon as Sealy released that Wolf 2, they changed that body ever so slightly. They made the actual back of the body look a little thinner than before. The Wolf Zero has a thicker back body. The Wolf 2 has a slimmer body. And then the hood on the Wolf 2 is just a little bit more curvaceous. And uh, the design, again, we're going with sleekness. We're talking about sleekness. Then as soon as Silly said, you know what? We're on to something. Let's go ahead and release the Wolf Pro. In releasing the Wolf Pro, guys, check that body out they actually changed that body style and gave us more squared off edges and no more rounded features, so to speak. Now, something that the Wolf 2 and the Wolf Zero, they have it, but man, this Wolf Pro coming in at $170. Again, that's before the discount code, $170 for an RMR, three MOA and guys get this right here this baby right here the glass is recessed in from this hood like on the wolf pro they actually bevel the darn hood or the shroud if you want to call it that they bevel that shroud enough to where you get to sink that glass off in there which that's what gives them the ability to be so durable racking it off anything you want to put it on and um again that back body is far more slender and the feature that i mentioned <laughs> i absolutely love that sealy went with that rear little notch for sights it gives you the ability to actually run factory sights if you choose to a factory front sight removing your rear sight i don't know that i'll ever do that um but the wolf pro was an absolute stunner but then Sealy went and outdid it my absolute favorite optic from Sealy. it is the wolf x pro guys i have the wolf x pro on my beretta 92 compact and oh my goodness this optic it is amazing hear me tell you it is amazing clear clear hammer down um here's the most beautiful thing or one of the most beautiful things about the sealy wolf x pro get this not only guys does it come in at a whopping 225 dollars for an optic of this caliber 225 dollars all of them have the shake weight technology so that's a dope thing but for this one right here, you get the choice of any one of the three options in the X series. All of Sealy's X series give you the option of the multi reticle feature inside. You can either run now. This one has a two MOA dot, which if you've shot three MOA, six MOA, it fills up a lot of that window. The two MOA uh, dot is beautiful it's so small that it actually gives me now I, guys i can't talk about nobody else but me the two moa dot paired with i think it's the 24 millimeter a uh, uh, 24 moa ring around here i actually run this dot with both of them 
I don't run it with just the two MOA dot. I actually run it with the two MOA dot and the 24 millimeter ring and got it is beautiful. It is the perfect size. It does not cloud the window. It does not give you too much information to run on. And guys, this by far is my favorite Wolf Pack member. This is the Alpha. This is the Alpha Wolf right here. I mean, on presentation, <laughs> goodness gracious. That is beautiful. Oh, that is beautiful. But this is what we're gonna do. I can't touch the Wolf X Pro. I can't touch it. I cannot move it off because it is dialed in to a crisp. So I won't touch it. What I thought about doing was giving you some footage of, oh, let me show you. Clear, clear, hammer down. What I thought about showing you is footage of Dalton's trigger dad. That's him right here. Follow him for some amazing content as well. But I happen to have his CZ Shadow 2 Compact in my vicinity. And ladies and gentlemen, I'm in love. I am so in love with this firearm. I mean, every oh goodness, everything about it from ergonomics to the grip on this gun, it is amazing. CZ has long been an amazing company. They produce amazing firearms. And I would like to say, I believe that they lived up to the hype with this compact. They really did. And so much so, so we're gonna get a CZ Shadow 2 compact. It will be the closer project of the year. I think it's only right that we get it over to Tummy Gun Stippling and get his crazy eight port package on there. I've seen Dalton run this thing and oh my goodness, the gun runs amazing. Um, I don't have to shoot it. I'm very familiar with the CZ brand. I've owned a few CZs and I'm saying to get my hands on one of these would be absolutely amazing. Uh, currently, they are out of stock at Brownells, but I have my alert set. And as soon as the notification goes off, I will be picking me up a CZ Shadow 2 Compact from Brownells using the discount code GAMAGE10 and saving 10% on that gun. Ladies and gentlemen, I can't wait, but I need your help. I know you heard me rave and, 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 and yell about how much I love the Wolf X Pro from Sealy, which I absolutely do. Should we go ahead and get another Wolf X Pro for the CZ? Should we? Or should we go with the Trijicon SRO? I don't know if I want to do another SRO. Uh, I love them. I do love them. I do love them. But it's something about what, what Sealy's been able to do with the durability of the glass in theirs. And uh, yeah, man, it's just something that you don't have to worry about. With the SRO, I've had an SRO crack. And it was actually on my last trip to Brownells, my SRO cracked in the luggage, ladies and gentlemen. It cracked while in the luggage. Um, and that hurt, that hurt, man. We got to Brownells, we got to Iowa, and I had that gun to shoot while we were up there. And so it was so tragic that, and I, man, big ups to my brother Dalton and my brother Greg. I absolutely love them um, for their heart. And um, yeah, here's, here's a beautiful thing. We're actually going to be giving away two of these optics. Two of these optics are gonna get given away and it's gonna be a raffle. First place, second place. First place gets to choose whichever one they want. Second place gets to choose the next one. If you are interested in winning one of these optics of your choice, 
one of these optics of your choice, all I need you to do is subscribe to the page and stay locked for the giveaway. The giveaway is next as soon as we hit 2,000 followers here on YouTube. It's going down, guys, and we're right around the corner from that. So I thank you so much. I thank you, thank you, thank you so much for everything that you do to help me grow, to help uh, the channel grow. I'm glad that I get to connect with these different companies to be able to bring you products and get you discount codes on things. That's what the win is for me. So, um, guys, again, I told you this video was going to be short. Uh, and, and for the person who does win these, I want you to know they have not been mounted at all on anything. I made it a point to not put them on it so that you get a brand new optics. Thanks to the people over at Sealy Optics. You get to have one of these for free as soon as we hit 2000 followers. Either way, you're going to be blessed. I am already blessed because you're here. And so let's just keep growing, man. Until next time, until we get our hands on the shadow two compact and we get to revolutionize it with either the wolf x pro or we're going to revolutionize it with an sro but most likely we're going to revolutionize it with another wolf x pro until then guys don't forget i will put all of the discount codes for each of these in the description head over to Sealy Optics, shop with confidence. Understand uh, budget optics have come a long, long way. And um, at this point, days are gone for us spending $400, $500 for an optic. God knows I've had my share of that. And so, uh, yeah, until then guys, never compare, never complain, and never compete. Why? Because you, are the threat. Deuces.